every free man shall have within his own woods hawks, sparrow hawks, falcons, eagles, and herons, and shall have also the honey that is found within his woods. Something that I'd like to pick out from that is the specification of honey. Honey was incredibly expensive back in those days. It still is moderately expensive today. But back then, it wasn't something that you could just get. Unless someone kept bees or were able to go into the forests, you would not have access to honey. Now, what this meant is that the natural products of nature, the things that animals make in the forest when your back is turned and you're not looking, were now available to the common man. 